इंजीनियरिंग भी अडानी से है जॉब भी अडानी में है और अब तुम्हारा एमबीए भी अडानी से चल रहा है जमेंट सब so okay. in managed by learning management subjects also i get to learn about marketing i get to learn about finance i yeah. get to learn about strategic management etc and because of that like uh, clarity of thoughts is very clear in my mind hello everyone and welcome to this interactive video where we have rishabh shah and he is right now doing his mba okay uh, in the first year of ai dtm college which is okay from the adani group okay so adani institute of digital technology management gandhinagar so great uh, first year rishabh welcome to this uh, video thank you sir so rishabh uh, as you we were just talking before we actually started off the recording here uh, okay. about your profile okay that and you being the the real adani product okay right from the engineering <laughs> okay then work ex and now uh, so and, and obviously adani is one of the most prestigious groups okay corporate groups in our country so Got tell it. tell us something about yourself okay tumhara kya profile hai okay what is about your profile in detail yeah so basically after 12 i have joined adani institute of infrastructure engineering to pursue my engineering so i have done my graduation in field of electrical engineering from there so during my graduation also i have done lot many internship in companies like ongc lnt and adani power also as well so after that uh, i have got opportunity to work with adani ports uh, so after the graduation i joined adani ports uh, in mundra so That's at there i have worked for 2 years and basically i was taking care of the all of the operation activities at there after that i taken decision to join this institute of adani institute of digital technology management to pursue my mba and post graduation sir engineering bhi adani se hai job bhi adani mein hai aur ab tumhara mba bhi adani se chal raha hai right <laughs> right that that's a, that's a very unique combination so yes. ke, mba ki cheez you know when, when did this come into picture I mean kabhi decide kiya ki mba karna hai ओके सो इंजीनियरिंग में प्लान था था कि जॉब में आने के बाद सोचा कैसे कैसे ये प्लान किया है एमबीए का एक्चुअली ऐसा था कि तो इसलिए मैंने पहले वर्क एक्सपीरियंस लिया अदानी से ही और जब वेन आई वॉज वर्किंग विथ अदानी सो इन डे टू डे बेसिस डिसीजन मेकिंग आई हैव टू टेक यू नो आई टू यूज सम काइंड ऑफ डेटा एनालिसिस I was doing it unknowingly. At that time, as I was not knowing that I was using the data analysis. So, उसके बाद ऐसा था कि after मतलब much later I get to know about like कि this is the only data analysis which I was using earlier. So I get more interest into it. So yeah. that's why on the same time like this institute has also just opened. Yes. So that's why I have taken admission in this institute. And also like data analytics field is like growing. exponentially in our country yes, yes. so there is lots of opportunity lots of job opportunity lots of career growth opportunity so that's why i have taken decision to uh, get into this institute so so uh, that means uh, while you were doing engineering that time only you were clear that okay, you want to go for an mba later on sometime yes yes correct acha acha great so uh, job mein ja ke you no know, you said that the work that you were doing okay that was you didn't know that it is something related to data analytics only okay data science only 
ఇంపోర్ట్సెస్టర్ <laughs> so that we resources don't get waste yeah. so for that unknowingly look for that we have to do some analysis we have to fetch report from the system we have to do analysis in the excel etc so at that time was well, i was not using like high end tool like i was using right i am using right now okay. but i was uh, using some basic analysis tool like excel and the basic statistics etc so that kind of uh, role i was doing at urban import okay all right so i think so that was that was a lot of decision making based on numbers okay that you were doing that thing yes correct but we use the decision in a particular okay great. like yes yeah, so like how my pendency how much my pendency is there so based on the pendency i have to you know tell the vendor like uh, i need uh, this much of uh, this much amount of itvs i need this much amount of labor so yes अच्छा सो ये अडानी इंस्टीट्यूट के बारे में पता कैसे चला आई मीन हाउ डिड यू अप्लाई टू एआईडीटीएम ओके एंड थ्रू व्हिच एग्जाम डिड यू अप्लाई एंड एवरीथिंग एक्चुअली सोशल मीडिया से भी पता चला मेरे को भी सोशल मीडिया से भी मैंने पोस्ट देखी थी अडानी ग्रुप में भी मेरे एक दो कलीग है उनसे पता चला और मेरे एक फैकल्टीज भी है जो ऑलरेडी मेरे इंजीनियरिंग में थे तो सबसे मतलब पता चला मेरे को कि इंस्टीट्यूट इज जस्ट लाइक ओपन इन 2020 so yes i got admission in 2021 to pursue big data analytics and one more interesting thing is like when the engineering adani engineering college started at that time also i i was in the first batch and in this college also i am in the first batch so <laughs> it is one more interesting acha yeah actually so big so you are doing uh, mba in big data analytics right yes in big data so, yeah. yeah so tell me okay because you are coming from a working you know working background also okay yeah so uh, how much do you see okay uh, in terms of you know the change in yourself okay by learning these new tools okay and all that yeah. so you know what are you learning here your big data analytics is, is something which is uh, definitely a very hot cake okay this time okay do you guys but many people still don't know okay they are confused okay that you know if they want to do an mba in big data analytics okay whether they should do it or not do it so tell me right. something about the course that you're doing here okay so like i was telling you earlier like uh, in my earlier job experience i was using basic data analysis tool like excel and basic statistics so right now i am using more advanced tool and i am also learning the more advanced tools like the r python which is the most prominent tool for data analysis also i am learning power bi tableau etc yeah. okay uh, so also for the big data we are using hadoop hive pig etc tools so these are the more advanced tools you know for the data analysis so from the loads of chunk of data we have to find some insightful information so that business can use that information so our main role is this and also apart from like uh, so itne sare tools ka naam jo tumne diya okay all these things so you are getting exposure to all these tools here yes yes i am getting exposure of the all the tools like uh, right now i am uh, i am studying in the third trimester so yes. some tools i have learned in first trimester some tools i have learned in second and some tools i have learned in third trimester so and tell us something some years. example okay tell us some example okay which probably okay a student who has not got into you know the college okay he can they can understand better so okay koi okay. aisa scenario batao okay that you know, this is the data and we have to find out something and you know which tool you use and you know probably what information did Correct. you get right all uh, right 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 so i am taking example of like time series forecasting of nifty 50 stock okay 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 so uh, what we did uh, like i used the python programming uh, python language so okay. i got the data uh, from the excel itself like in excel we have feature to fetch stock data yes. so i have fetched the stock data of uh, nifty 50 uh, from the excel itself yes. so after that i have imported it into the python by okay. using the coding like uh, basic coding yeah yes so after importing uh, this data in python uh, you know i have to uh, implement the time series forecasting 
for yes. that also some packages are there in python so i have used those, those packages for to do the time series forecasting and uh, I, I have also added some exogenous factor like what is impacting nifty like uh, nifty is directly related to like sgx and dow jones so yeah. i have also added some exogenous factor in uh, that data also like the data of sgx on the same timeline and data of dow jones also on the same timeline so that my analysis can be you know more fruitful and more insightful okay. and more accurate so i have uh, based on the like past historical data i have predicted the future like what price will be in nifty 50 in future so for the next uh, 12 months i have predicted the price of the nifty 50 okay so, so you, that, you can so, predict one project the, how will stocks behave okay probably in future okay that's what yes. you okay. yes correct so this is the one project i have done lot many project like this yeah 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 so this is interesting i mean you're getting to yes. learn all this okay in this program okay definitely okay Good. correct and this is like part of uh, data analysis part also we are learning uh, management subjects as well so okay. in managed by learning management subjects also i get to learn about marketing i get to learn about finance i get yeah. to learn about strategic management etc and because of that like uh, clarity of thoughts is very clear in my mind yes yes, yes yes like earlier i was very confused you know while taking some decision yeah. so right now i'm very clear like what will i do how will i do i'm very clear about it okay and what about like you know when you're learning these uh, these skills here okay are you also yeah. getting to apply that probably in some life project or some internship okay when you are yes, applying that yes definitely yes so right now i have been selected for the two companies for the summer internship okay. i'll be joining there uh, from the 4th april uh, 2022 so uh, first i will join the only uh, it is the us based company so okay. that company is doing a data analysis of the hollywood uh, movie production company oh, okay. so they are tying up with, they have a uh, contract with the warner brothers sony etc sony media etc okay. so i will be doing a uh, data analysis for that company for the two months and after that i will be joining adani technology development team for okay. summer internship so i will be doing two in summer internship in oh you you months. got two offers okay uh, for yes. summer yes 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 great 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 and uh, now now okay now this is this is about okay the uh, you know the, your overall development there okay yeah uh, tell us something okay with regards to okay what is what is that you are aiming at okay i mean i know you're right now uh, just in the first year okay we internship and all that but still right. okay like you know with, with with your second year okay of mba coming in okay and then probably the placements again everything okay so yeah. apne career goal ko okay tumne abhi you know, big data analytics pad rahe ho usko leke you know what is that you want to achieve okay what is that you want to you know, reach as a goal or the target of career of course so like after pursuing big data analytics i want to join company uh, you know as a role where like i can use my uh, learning of analytics to uh, you know solve some business problem so yeah. as a business analyst or as a business analyst or data analyst i want to join a uh, good reputed companies yeah okay okay so, so this is uh, my ultimate goal yeah. yes yes after yes. completing the course so what is going to be your advice okay for someone uh, you know who is probably confused okay ki usko you know, mba big data analytics okay ya technology management okay jaise courses karna chahiye ya usko you know ek general mba jo hota hai wo karna chahiye so between the two if 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 you have to suggest someone okay you know, then why would you suggest someone right. to big data राइट right. सो so, लाइक like, अगर किसी को जनरल एम करना है तो जनरल एम में तो नॉर्मल जो रूटीन सब करते हैं रूटीन सब्जेक्ट जो मैनेजमेंट मार्केटिंग फाइनेंस वो जनरल एम में सब करते हैं वो करने का मेरा मैं जब मैंने ये कोर्स ज्वाइन किया तो मेरा भी ऐसा था कि जनरल एम करने का कोई मतलब नहीं क्योंकि सब वही कर रहे हैं एवरीबडी इज डूइंग द सेम so yes. in what i am learning here like i am learning all the subjects with general mba people are learning okay. i am learning finance i am learning operation i am learning logistic i am learning strategic management i am learning consumer behavior so all the management subjects i am learning here and apart from those management subjects i am also learning the data analytics subject so okay. people will like students will learn more by joining here yeah they will learn management subjects and the data analytics and there is a value addition ki matlab jo general mba ke upar bhi koi cheez hum seekh rahe hain yahan pe 
correct correct and this also like as i said earlier this data analytics field is very emerging in india right now like we are saying like data is a new oil or we can say data is a new gold for everyone yes so every company is uh, uh, digital every company is transforming their business into towards digitalization yes so yes for that the data analysis part is very important and very crucial yes so yes. like that's why i suggest every students to you know join this kind of course you know where they can uh, solve some complex business problem yes 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 great i think okay this is this is a great insight coming from someone you know who's probably uh, yeah. i mean your career has taken a very good shape till now okay and we wish you all the best okay, in future as well and uh, thanks a lot for finding some time okay to guide students with regards to the yeah. discipline of big data analytics okay and uh, technology management okay the emerging two fields in mba as well so thanks yes. a lot rishabh for all your time